In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Wix automations to Microsoft Excel. It's really easy to do, but make sure you pay close attention to ensure that you get it all correct. So the first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to go onto this website called Zapier. And on Zapier, this is going to allow us to automate some things. So I'm going to go to the top left and click on the Create Zap section. From here, it's going to ask me for a trigger. Now, we're going to set Wix automations as the trigger. So I'm going to type in Wix here. And it should allow us to connect our Wix account up. So we're going to click Wix. And it's going to ask us for the event. Now, if we're going to use the Wix automations one, then we're going to need to scroll all the way to the bottom. And we're going to go to the Wix custom triggers. So we're going to click on that there. Now we can click continue. It's going to ask us to link up our account. I've already linked mine, but you can basically link yours up here. And then once it's linked up, we're going to go ahead and click continue. So now it's going to ask for the trigger. And you can see here, I don't actually have any triggers set up. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to go into Wix and go to our automation section. Now, this is where we're going to need to set up an automation first. So new automation. And what you set up here really depends on your needs. So we could have... Um, we could have any of these really. I'm going to click this one here and I'm going to set up this automation here. I'm just going to activate it. And any second now it should be ready to go. Cool. The, the new automation is now active. So if it's applicable and it works, I'm going to refresh this. If I can use it, it should show up here. Um, Obviously, we can't use that one, but when you do one that you can use, it should show up in here like this. We can go ahead and click finish like that, and that's set up this first trigger. Now, we're going to go down to the action section. This is where we're going to link up Microsoft Excel. So, what we're going to do is type in Excel in here, and you can see Microsoft Excel has now been created. So, for this is going to be the event. So, what's going to happen? So, there's a lot of things we could do. We could add a row, add row to table, create spreadsheet, update row. I'm going to add row click continue. It's going to ask me to sign in. So I'll sign into my Excel account. And from there, what you can do is you can select the spreadsheet and all that that's going to send the event to. So you can set up a lot of automations. For example, if a customer buys something, it can send to a row in Excel. So that's basically how you go about doing it. Once you've finally done all that, you can turn it on, publish it, and it will be ready to go and automated. So if you enjoyed the video and found it useful, be sure to like, subscribe and comment down below that it helped. Thank you for watching.